right, so we just voted. Um, we did mail-in ballots. We just dropped it off. It's around 6.59, 7 p.m. And we got our little stickers. It says, I voted. How do you feel that you voted? Do you feel like relief off your chest that it's done? Baby. Babe. Yes. <laughs> Why don't know you paying attention to me? I thought you was talking to the people. I'm talking to you. I'm not talking to the people. I'm talking to you. I'm just glad to get it done and over with and ready for the results. Hopefully there's a change. Hopefully. Alright, I'll check in once we get to my mom's. We are on the way to my mom's house because my birth brother's birthday was October 26th. So we're gonna have some dinner together as a family. She's cooking the steaks, Donald made potatoes. I volunteered his services. <laughs> um, so we're on our way to my mom's. Sorry, it's dark in here, y'all. It's nighttime now. Um, let's see if I can do this. There we go. See me a little bit better. Um, go that way to get to my mom's. So I'll check in once we get there. Alright, so I'm at my mom's house and we're gonna go visit the birthday boy. This is not the birthday boy today, but this is one of my brothers, Marcus. Here's the birthday boy. <laughs> they say we look alike. Do y'all see the resemblance? That's my other brother. So this is the oldest son. Then the second oldest son, and then the third, he's a baby, he's playing a video game. I got a big, big tickle. I am recording, man. Okay, we're gonna go to the kitchen. This is my mom's fish tank. She got fish tank goals. In my book bag. This fish all by itself. I'm not about to feed y'all. My dad, say hi, dad. Hey, how you doing? Don't you put me on that? <laughs> hey! Don't do that, no. Hey, cake. Oh, where's the potatoes? Oh, you putting the potatoes in? You having steak I'll and put potatoes. A Put the cap on. Now, now. You said ball, right? Y'all can start eating. You gonna put a cap on? Uh oh. We matching. Uh oh. I got grace. So? <laughs> she told us she's gonna put a basketball cap on. So you can say hi to the people. Oh, you gotta get the glasses. Cute glass, not the ugly glass. Are you serious right now? We don't got time for that. You should have been ready before I came over here. <laughs> Who gonna be saying it? People. You ready? Oh. She got braids in just like I do. Jesus. You ready now? Yeah. Oh my Thanks. God. Hello, everybody. Yes, she wants me to come on camera with these gray braids uh -oh. in my hair. The smoke detector going off. Hi. Uh oh. If you want to get some, put this on camera. No. All right, we close the darn thing. Oh, Are you right? saying? Yeah, put this on camera. Yeah, buddy. You gonna get the smoke detector? How about that? Put that on camera. Yeah. Well, she ripped. <laughs> Do you happy birthday, dear Matthew? Happy birthday to you. One, two, three. Happy birthday. Uh, I hope so. 
Go ahead, Matt. Blow it like a He's so handsome. Don't spit on it now. Yay! I go first. All right, what's up? Um, so it's Sunday. It's around 5 p.m. Um, I'm about to get ready to go to a costume party. Um, but I had to wake up this, well, I didn't wake up this, I did wake up this morning, but then I went back to sleep. <laughs> so, um, y'all just saw Saturday it was, um, it wasn't my little brother's birthday officially, but we was, that's the day we decided to celebrate and he wanted steaks, um, for the whole family to celebrate. So my mom got us all steaks and we had birthday cake. And we just chilled with family. And then today I slept in to like noon and got up and did some homework because I still had two assignments that I didn't finish. Um, for some reason, my professor had two assignments due this week. I don't know why, but yeah, we had two assignments due this week. Um, one was a reflect reflective journal. Um, and one was a discussion post. Both were pretty easy after I had to do them and I just finished them and whatnot. Um, it just required us to watch a video this week um, for each one and just to talk about the video. So I'm glad that they were actually easy. And I'll show you guys how much I wrote. I wrote like a paragraph for each, like there's three questions for each assignment and you just have to write a substantial amount. That's what she says. So my substantial amount is like a paragraph. And we know paragraphs are five to six sentences. So that's how much I wrote. I wrote probably a little bit more, but I'm gonna show you guys. Camera won't focus. But this is what I wrote. And this is not a ad or anything, but let me flip the camera back over. But when I am... Ugh, I can't talk. However, um, when I do write these discussion posts and things like that, I try to... I have really bad grammar and spelling. Um, so to help with that, I do have Grammarly. And Grammarly is just a website where you can upload your work and then it just checks your spelling and your grammar. It's not, you know, the most perfect thing, but it does help a lot for me. Um, but I'll show you guys the website if you guys are not familiar with it. This is not an ad or anything. I'm not sponsored by them. I literally paid my money for this for the, the whole year. And I'm going to pay for it next year, too, because I know I, that's something I struggle with. And I didn't want to I didn't want to come to grad school posting discussion posts that was bad. <laughs> and, you know, like no no structure, no, you know, Microsoft Word does but so much. So I'm going to show you guys the website. Um, Actually, let's check my account and see how much I pay for this. Yeah, so you have options to pay monthly or for the year. And I decided to do it for the year because you know you get like a little discount when you do for the year. And right now I'm paying $139 for the year. And my subscription renews September 4th in 2021. So that's how much I'm paying for this website. Um, I do recommend it if you are in school and you need help with writing um, and you don't have anybody to edit your papers or anything, your discussion posts for you, this is a really good website to use. And you can do it monthly. I think monthly it's like, okay, so I'm going to turn my camera around and show you guys what it's showing me on my side. I don't know if this is going to show differently for you guys. But I can show you what is on my website. So let me turn the camera around. Hopefully, 
So if I want to change my plan, these are the options. So this is what I'm doing right now, the one $11.16 a month, but I paid a one-time fee of $139.95. If you do the quarterly, it's $19.98 a month. So you see that big difference. That's why I said I did the year one because you get it's cheaper. Um and then this one is $29.95 a month. So I decided to do the annually. But we're not going to update that. But yeah. It's really simple to use. I might do a video to show you guys how easy it is to use. Uh, you literally just copy. Uh, you know what? I can just show you guys now. It's not that big a deal. Um, I do have to get to the party before 8 o'clock. Because before 8 it's free. And your girl ain't trying to pay to go to no party. Um, all right, so let me turn the camera back around. So control all, control copy. All right, I opened up a new document, call here, control. This is hard to do with the camera in my hand, paste. And then it asks you all these different things like who's your audience, the formality, the domain, the tone. Um, I learned just to keep, I don't really change this stuff to be honest with you because it's just a discussion post and then it flags everything that it thinks needs to change and then these flags tell you what it is, I'm mm, sorry, it could be spelling, it could be word suggestions, you just click it, I'm sorry if the camera's not focusing. And see, it's saying, oh, that word is cool, but you can use these words to, like, make it sound better. So, see, those are different words I can choose. Sometimes it rewrites the sentence for you, gives you a suggestion. If you want to, you know, go ahead and if you read it and you like what it says, you can say rephrase sentence. You just click that. And then over here, it grades your paper. So, this is your score. And this shows you like each one of these has a red dot or a blue dot or a green dot and it just shows you this will go up as as you go further in the paper. Once I'm done editing it, once again, control copy or control all, control copy and then I go back to Word and paste it and save it on my computer. But Grammarly keeps all of your documents and stuff. Oh see all of my documents I like I use this thing a lot see I use this a lot so yeah so I just wanted to show you guys that I'm about to get dressed so I can make it to this party on time because I sometimes yeah no procrastinate and I'm late all the time but I'm trying to be on time tonight so I can make it in for free so I'm gonna post some videos of our costumes this year and I'm also gonna post a video showing you where I got my costume stuff um and how to get some ideas for next year for yourselves all right and don't forget to hit that like button that subscribe button down below and if you're not following me on instagram yet make sure you follow me on instagram at queen niobe but keep on watching the rest of this vlog Coming, you know these knees ain't like they used to be, you know. Listen, all that Megan, that stallion. I know I don't got the Megan knees no more. Oh Lord, I think I left my inhaler. We gonna have to go to revival. What time the revival started again? It start at eight. You always running late now. <sighs> you think by now you've been used to it? Come on now. Oh, that thing's still poking. Oh, you know I still can make you jiggle a little bit. Mm hmm, mm -hmm. Come on now. Drake, you say I hate to let, let you go, but I like to watch you leave.
<laughs> I'm like, hell. All right, so I wanted to end this short little weekend vlog with just updating you guys about the day after the party. Um, the party was super fun. Um, we both, me and Donald, both enjoy dressing up as old people and literally the crowds went wild as soon as we even walked in the party um we got a lot of attention a lot of videos out there of us acting a fool at this people's party as old people um it was a lot of fun guys like it was lit uh, much needed um especially with me about to get into these books i got essays that are due um in the next two weeks well there's one due this week and then i have another one due next week so yeah pray for your girl because i have a lot of papers to write um but the party was fun y'all we killed it um and just to show you guys that i'm not just talking they um so at this party we went to this party same party last year and they do a costume competition um sorry i don't want to block the speaker but like i was saying this party we went last year and it was fun last year so that's why we wanted to go again this year and we're kind of a little salty because we didn't win the costume competition they did last year there was this girl that was dressed like Megan Thee Stallion. She won first place. So we've been plotting this for a while. For a whole year. And we won this year. We got the trophy. The first place trophy. Isn't it so cute? And on it it says. First place 2020 costume party at day party. Day party. It's called day party day party. So that's their at. If you guys are wondering what party we went to you can find them on instagram and it was a really good party y'all it's our second year going like i said and definitely will be going back next year if they have it again and we're already plotting what our next costume is going to be and to be honest this costume was super easy to make um i went to goodwill which i already showed you guys a clip of um um, if I haven't showed it yet in this video, I don't know where I'm going to put it when I edit this, but I went to Goodwill, got the, the dress from there, my dress, and then Donald's hat I got from Goodwill, um, and his beard and, um, eyebrows and mustache I got from Goodwill. What else did I get from Goodwill? Um, the canes and the walker I got from Goodwill. And then the pearls that was on my glasses, my my eyeglass chain, I don't know what you call those things. I got that from the dollar store. I got Donald's glasses from the dollar store. I just popped the frames out. What else? Donald, he already had those clothes. So he put that ensemble together from his closet. I already had those shoes and I got the stockings um, from the dollar store. I already had the purse. I already had most of the like jewelry and stuff. Like my pearls and stuff are mine. And yeah, the wig I got from the hair store. It was like $20 for that wig. Um... I had to get my hair braided. That was $45. Y'all know this lady charged me $45 to braid my hair. And I was in so much pain, y'all. Like, she was not being gentle at all. But this is my braid. It's braided together. But my braids have grown. My hair grow has grown a lot. But she's probably damaged it after blow drying my hair. First of all, she was yanking my hair with the comb. And then was yanking my head with the blow dryer. And then, oh my god, like. $45 to sit through two hours of pain basically but anyways I'm off topic but the Halloween costumes were easy to put together oh and my fake butt uh, literally was just 
Donald's biking shorts. They're stretchy. So I put those on underneath and then I stuffed the, one of my small pillows in my butt. And that's how I got my fake butt. It was a pillow. Somebody in the party touched my butt and was in the bathroom. And she's like, oh, I thought that was you. Like, girl, you drunk. This, you knew that was not my butt. It's too big. I've seen a lot of fake butts and I've never seen one that big. So, but yeah. I just wanted to check in with you guys before I end this vlog and show you our trophy. <laughs> Yo, this was definitely uh, one for the books. So we're going to have to start doing more things, more competitions, and just have like our little trophy wall or something. Me and Bae's trophies, because you know we first placed out here, first place, first place. But anyways, if you guys like this vlog, make sure you hit that like button down below. If you're not subscribed to my channel yet, make sure you hit that subscribe button and that notification bell. Also, if you're not following me on Instagram yet, make sure you head over to Instagram and follow me at Queen Niobe. Um, that's where I'll, you know, I post mainly. I don't really do vlogs every day. So if you want to keep up with me in my life, that's where you will go to find me. All right, guys. Like always, peace, love, and happiness. Kings and queens. Queen Niobe's out. Bye.